He's like the Grim Reaper right now for her Pichus. Yes. <laughs> the bracket demon, new bracket demon unlocked. Yeah, yeah. But you know what? Let's see if Carflo can uh, take this against Mr. E. I would say that while Carflo's cloud is phenomenal, right? Don't get me wrong. Mm. It is not as strong as their Croy. It's their Croy. Their That's Croy. what it was. The LaCroix is just still a little bit better, <laughs> just because they put in more hours at this point. Right, right. But this cloud is still dangerous. Look at that. Yeah. And you know, this is what weeklies are for, figuring it out. And the grind sessions. If you only come to weeklies, well, you know, go to more weeklies. <laughs> okay. The limit is charged. It looks like Powerful is just kind of waiting for, like, just holding on to it for the better movement, better speed. A bit of a missed input there from Mr. E as it gets caught by that wave beam. And at this level, at this gameplay, you can't afford one missed input, or else you're going to catch a neutral B limit, right? Right. Because Cloud's moves come out fast and come out strong. But this is where Cloud can struggle off stage. Mm -hmm. And he loses his limit to using the uppie. And let's see if Mr. E can work with it while he's still down. Now, usually people don't think that Cloud has a very good edge guard game, but throwing out the wave beam is actually pretty good for these recoveries to keep uh, who, Mr. Who e says Cloud doesn't have an edge guard game? Yeah, I was going to say, I watched the throne. You know, well, I thought we saw Spargo edge guarding like a god. Well, we were talking about the yesterday waypoint. It's like, oh, Cloud's not great off stage. I'm like, no, Cloud's pretty good off stage. Well, off stage is not the same as edge guarding. Ah. Uh, like, he'd be hitting you if you're trying to recover versus him. But yeah, I mean, he's got a pretty slow, he's got an exploitable recovery for sure, but it can still be pretty tough. Uh, you know, he can do stuff pretty right, but yeah, I think you just got your jargon mixed. Yeah, my bad. Oh, and he opts to burn the limit. I feel like he could have jumped an air dodge to ledge there. No, Misery was ready. Yeah. That forward smash would have taken him out. Mr. E spacing, God, good gracious. We've seen a lot more patient play here as both players are just kind of feeling themselves out. We see Mr. E kind of throwing a lot more down tilts, some forward airs, some safe on landing. But uh, Carflow, because here's the thing, Carflow I think has some, some more moves that are safer on neutral, hmm. while Mr. E kind of has to go for these grabs, go for these space back airs, and play more patiently than Cloud does. Yeah. Ooh, an untackable situation. That's like, that's the pros and cons of Lucina, is you're playing the most the fundies, like, not generic, but generic character in the game. Like, like, you are winning because you are good, you know? Yeah. But you know what? You can be as good as you want. You have a character. You have to have a character that rewards you for that. Yes. And that's the reason why Carflow was thinking of switching to full-time Cloud. Like, while Krom and Roy are great characters, then he does very well with them. Somebody like Cloud at a higher level is going to reward you much more than Roy and Krom. Right. As we're seeing right here. Yeah, just better options. Mm -hmm. So it's like, why wouldn't you want to go with a better tool? Right. Really good pivot crab. Uh oh. That car flow's in a bit of danger choking this lead that he had built up. Mystery doing a good job of just baiting out the limit wave blade, blade wave again. Yeah, he saw you added up and he's, I'm not approaching. I'm not approaching. You come approach me. Sent out that neutral B and Mystery was like, I was waiting for this. I knew it. And Carflo also has been doing a lot of just back and forth wave dashing. I was just like, when am I going in? When am I going in? <laughs> Mystery kind of learning to just wait. Yeah, stand still. <laughs> if you're not near Cloud, you're safe. But oh! you're never safe against that back air. Never, never. Carflo, are you shaking your head? You want that? What do you mean? <laughs> not good enough. Not, not good, good enough. enough. Always be improving. That's right. Hit the lab. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we saw there. Yeah, it was just right there. If at first you don't succeed, throw it out again. Exactly. I mean, that double jump really sealed the fates. He fast fell, and oh, oh god, it was like that last bit right there. Yeah. God. Tried to uh, tried the forward air. Oh, I see. Yeah. That came out right there. Yeah. If he had done just like an air dodge, it would have been safe. We actually did see that earlier in game one, where he did throw out that forward air, but he landed way too close to Cloud. Yeah. And now we're on a sword fighting stage as sword fighting can be. Final destination. Where are the foxes? <laughs> if you thought that Mystery was playing fundies before, he certainly is now. That's right. We're back to the good old days of Four Glory. Yeah. Really good patience there, waiting for Carflow to make the first move. Uh oh. No way. No way. Oh, okay. the limit brings you all <laughs> the way back. 
Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if Carful gets the limit again and will try and go for a finishing touch. He's been trying to get those confirms on, nah. but hasn't been working on Bracket just yet. Yeah, that would be a little bit crazy if he, Mr. E got hit by a finishing touch. I don't know. The way he's been spacing through this limit, that would well, be he crazy. he can get a little spooked. Yeah. <laughs> Who knew that Carful was going to have that get first game on lock? Mr. E trying to pressure on Sledge. Nothing happening just yet, but being a lot more mindful oh. of the back air. Whiffs and punish. I mean, God, it's just so strong. Once Claude has limit, you really have to bait out something from him to get rid of it. It's not like you can just keep hitting him over and over and over and beat it out of him. Right. Mr. E getting a little too forward air happy. Man, Carflow is just racking up the damage. He's at 81 at ledge where Cloud wants him to be, but comes back with a forward air that Carflow wasn't ready for. Oh my God, neutral get up. Spot dodge, get out of here. Yeah. <laughs> All right. He's We're gonna dead. see some harassment off stage. No. Ooh. Wasn't able to confirm a kill off stage, and this is gonna be something that is gonna be a big mistake if Mr. E can't close that out. There you go. There it is. But that was at 181. Mr. E can't afford another stock like that this far behind. No, he's gonna have to work it all the way back here. That means Carflow's gonna have to lose neutral more than once. Mm -hmm. Something he's been dominating in all games, so. I mean, Mr. E has been doing the correct thing and just going straight to ledge, but I think Harful is eventually going to be going for some down airs to try and contest that. Yeah. These space back airs from Cloud, it's... Look at that. Look at that. It's so That was three hard. in a row! And, and Mr. E knew another back air was coming. Oh! Beautiful. Yes. But now's the time. you got to go in. Saves the limit. And we're going to see just another cross slash. And look at that, the downers are coming out. It does go through the stage. Yeah. This is dangerous at 162. Now with Limit gone, I think we're going to see Mystery push a little bit harder. Unless those backers keep coming out. Yeah. Oh. It just feels like if one mistake is made, then the stock is over. Yep. Speaking of which. And it's almost like Carflow is throwing out twice as many moves as Mystery. And Mystery is getting around all of them. Mm -hmm. And, you know. It's just a lot safer. Yep. No way. Oh. Oh, recovers high. Nice. Okay, but what do we see here? Nice spot dodge. Good okay. Punch. This is not undoable. No, this what do you is think Mystery has to do? He has to win neutral. Let's go. <laughs> and I mean, Cloud yeah. is the master of neutral here. He has to avoid these back airs too, man. You know he's throwing out another one, right? Like, we've seen him throw out three in a row so many times, but... Mystery had the right idea there, was challenging that with a really fast neutral air. Has to kill now. Oh, no way! Oh! He's been working <laughs> on that. He's been working on that. Why are you shaking your head? Uh, that was clean! Yeah, you know what? Maybe at the end of game three, neither of them will shake their heads. They'll be happy with the outcome. That's right. <laughs> oh, he double jumped too. That was risky. Oh, oh, my God. That was crazy. He's been, we saw him do it last week, and I think we saw him do it the week before that, too. <laughs> He's he like, oh, yeah. I didn't think that was going to work. <laughs> yeah. That looks like a man who just clutched a victory from the jaws of defeat. Yeah. <laughs> All smiles. The footstool's the future. I think a lot of people are thinking that now. Who? Everybody. Yo. Let me tell you, foot, I'm far, foot I'm stooling, behind on everybody. footstooling, when people are in shield, you know? I think it sends them into tumble, right? No, it gives you like a little opportunity to like, uh, you know, yeah, puts a lot of shields. Yeah, you get yeah. some like neutral or confirmed, some downers with some characters. I know it's strong with Sephiroth. I know it's actually strong really with strong Steve. with Cloud. Steve as well. Yeah. Yes, with the anvil. Oh, yeah, good yeah, God. Yeah, yeah. So I know like there's. I think there's like a lot of people trying to like lab out footstool combos. Which is good. I think we need to see more optimization like that. Uh, get out of he here! Did the thing. No! He did the thing! Ooh, Carful is heated. I'd be heated too. <laughs> I mean, Mr. E, he's like, you know what? I did that twice. I think I can do it again. <laughs> if at first you don't succeed. Or, no, no, no. Fool me once. <laughs> what a counter. I mean, uh, you know, if Mr. E was getting a little too happy with the forward airs, Carflow is now getting all these back airs called out. Yeah. Dash attack because it's strong. <laughs> <gasps> oh! No way! The frame one Dolphin Slash beating out the limit cross break. No way. And here we go. Oh, I thought another footstool was about to come out there. No, but Mr. E is getting a lot more aggressive. I think this is the right play. It is dangerous, but Mr. E is in Carflow's head. Yeah, he's pushing him to his limit. Limits were meant to be broken. Yeah. <laughs> Finishing touch. 
No, and so we're going to see a blade beam. Oh, Ooh. I thought we were about to see a shield break. Listen, Carful had two options there. Am I going to try and parry this, or am I just going to take the hits? Lucina's a shield breaker is not that strong of hits, and you were on the other side. It was, it's fine. Take the damage. Yeah, and he's going to want to hold on to this stock as long as he can. Uh oh. All right, fall out. Fast falling neutral air. What do we see? Oh, a good air dodge down on stage. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh dear good lord. Tech. Oh. <laughs> I think Mystery was just cursing that that wasn't untackable. Yeah. <laughs> Hold it. Oh. And he calls out that back air with a neutral air. Yep. Now, little known fact, uh, that limit cross slash, I mean, sorry, the limit uh, wave beam, yeah. it can be counted as Lucina, but yeah. a little too far, and you're not really going to get anything off on it. Interesting. I'm, I'm surprised we're not seeing him run off to another footstool, honestly. And no, Carful is ready. That yeah. will be a, you know, a uh, climb hazard, yeah. but not at the last stock. We may see something fancy here. Yeah, Mystery's gonna have to maximize. Okay, we're try trying to get Carpool to just throw that out first. There we go. Why not? You're up, you know? Why would you approach there ever? You get a little too confident, make some mistakes. <laughs> oh, we're gonna play it out for fans. Great up tilt. And Mr. E is looking so comfortable. With a stock to give, he's gonna go deep. Of course, as you should. Give Carful no quarter. A great crab. Even with limit, I don't see what can be done here. You have to burn it. Yep. Another grab. Even Carful is like, God, what do I do? Yeah, every option at ledge, Mr. E is just, yeah. Beautiful backer to seal it out. Carflo, a good fist bump there. <laughs> but I wouldn't be happy with that game no, either. No, no. After that first stock, I'd be, I'd be a little upset too, honestly. I mean, let's look at this, exactly what happened here. So he goes in, gets him off stage, and yeah, he didn't even have a chance to recover and went into it. it. No, he actually goes for the double jump, and right there, the Dolphin Slash wasn't expecting that. Yeah. Was expecting Mr. E to just wait on stage. Yeah, like he could have teched it, but I don't think anybody ever techs that. <laughs> no. But, you know, that was a really good call back there. Even at 107, that limit cross slash will kill Mr. E even from that far off state, from that side of the stage. And yeah. we're starting to see that Mr. E starting to contest those back airs that gave him so much trouble that game one and even game two at points. Yeah, he's like, oh, you're throwing out three back airs in a row? Like, I'm just going to space this out with my neutral air and make sure that I'm not getting hit by this. Yeah, well, Big Easy, it's my time to swap out with Ritual over there. You guys are in good hands now. I'll be, you can always follow me on Twitter at Army Hermes. I will be casting here next week as well, right before I go for Christmas break. It's going to be a lot of fun, but you're going to have so much fun with the ritual and Big Easy here for Top 8. Catch y'all later.